It is a huge street party and everybody is invited. Tonight's spring art walk in downtown Lake Charles will be one for the record books. We've got Jody from the Arts Council here along with artist Heather Boston sharing a gorgeous painting that a lot of us actually got to watch you do over the course of a few weeks. Yes, it's beautiful. Tell us a little bit about the painting. <laughs> Um, I've worked on it for the past three um, three weeks of the live art walk. Um, that was that live at the lakefront, actually. At, you were set yeah, up on the front, stage sorry. during the, the concerts painting this, and it's astounding that this is what it ended up as. How did you actually apply the paint? Because that was fun to watch. With my fingers, <laughs> and it was a lot of fun because I was right by the speaker. So the vibrations of the speaker was just like vibrating with my hand, so it just kind of was just win one with the music and the paint. It was really amazing. It is an amazing painting. It's got a lot of movement to it, a lot of good vibrations, and someone's going to have the opportunity to buy this tonight. That's right. We're, uh, we'll have it for... Um, Heather has graciously donated this piece for um, silent auction tonight. So we'll have that at the Arts Council home base at um, 800 Ryan Street. Where exactly is that if someone's not certain? It's right on the intersection of Ryan and Broad. Um, right next to Stein Financial Building um, and some other tenants in that building. But um, we, we definitely encourage everybody to come out and, and just view this painting. There's so many hidden um, pieces. And it's just beautiful. Yeah, you really have to see it in person to be able to appreciate just how special it is. And someone, again, is going to be able to, to leave tonight with this painting. Leaving tonight to a bunch of surprises. There's so much going on tonight. We're it's really incredible. excited. Yes, this is a, just a great showcase of Lake Area Arts from the indoor exhibits to the art war competition, performances on the street from all sorts of arts organizations. I mean, this is really a full force showing of, of what Lake Charles has to offer. And I have to say, just a, a, in as being part of, of organizing the event for several years now, this is the largest one that we've ever produced. Yes, it's grown each year. It's, it's just amazing. Uh, there's so much support. And, and again, it just shows the richness of our culture. Um, I think that gets lost a lot. So it's great to have this event where everyone is in the same space. You can really see just how much there is. It really is going to be incredible. There are so many artists involved this year that there's no way that we can mention them all. But we do know there's going to be about 50 artists set up in the street selling their work. That's right. I think it's at 56 now. We have 56 oh, vendors, that's and that's amazing. just what's in the art market. There's also, like I said, all the indoor exhibits, I think 17 or 18 stops. Um, so, yeah, there's just so much to see. How do we find out where the stops are? Where do we go? Well, ha we have a full list at our website at artscouncilswla.org. Uh, there's some great previews of some work at the, uh, the Facebook for the Arts Council. Um, also, we'll have these really awesome uh, maps um, that have a listing of each um, indoor exhibit, the outdoor performance schedule. Uh, you can pick that up at the Arts Council table. It's a very easy, walkable route, and you're going to really enjoy yourself. Be sure to come downtown tonight from 5 to 9. There is so much in store that we didn't even mention, including life-size board games that you're going to be able right. to play, <laughs> a beer garden, live performances out on the street. It's going to be a blast. Thank you both so much for coming by. Thank, Thank you for having us. us. Yeah. All right, stay with us. We're going to wrap things up for you after the break.